Let the market be the market. Let's just continue watching as many breadcrumbs as we can see and make sure that we do our best to continue to be on the right side of that. What The breadcrumbs that I'm looking at today from this channel that we've been in, we're at the lower range. I want to buy some more spot Bitcoin. I feel good about that, right? And then this one over here, same thing from this vantage point using the log scale, the trend lines that we follow, long-term adoption. Do I think we could come as far down as the blue line? Do I think we're going to take out the mid-cycle low, by the way, the golden ratio? That would be different. By the way, anything could happen. It's the markets. If you're into spot Bitcoin and your stop loss is not zero, if you would want to, if you saw some type of anomaly happening, make sure that you de-risk yourself on spot and spot alone. This might be one level you're looking for, whether it's the break of the trend line, the blue line, and or the break of the mid-cycle low. That's an important point to watch, as is this one over here. Price has never broken below the all-time high of the previous cycle, right? Price also never broke below the peak of wave one, and it did now. So could things happen that never happened before? Sure they can. What would you do? By the way, this was an anomaly. What did I do? I went ahead and I just added as much leverage as I was able to, right? If you, this broke again, would you be looking for this to be a buy, or would you be looking to deleverage? Just like sit with that today, sit with that over the next days and figure out so that if something is occurring in real time, you're able to go ahead and maneuver.